Hey, what's going on? I'm back with another unboxing video. This is day two of owning the Apple Vision Pro. I have been wearing this thing. I'm, I'm going to bring you another video of my experience wearing this thing. I've been wearing this thing almost nonstop. I'll take it off when I go to work, but I'm all around the house with this thing. Everything but a shower with this thing. I wish I could take it in the shower. That's how much I'm loving this headset. So I'm going to loosen this up. Take this off. Back to reality. Um, I'm actually, I'm absolutely loving it. I'm loving this thing. It's, it's exceeded my expectations of what the Apple Vision Pro is going to be and can be. But today, I just received this box right here. So I plan on showing some friends. I plan on, I want to DJ with this thing eventually. So what I did was I went online. Instead of getting a $200 Apple case, I brought this case. Now, this is my first time opening as you see. I'm going to move this box to the side. I saw the Apple Vision Pro case at the Apple Store. And my first initial reaction is this looks really small compared to the Apple Vision Pro case. The Apple Vision Pro case, when you sit it down, sat like about this high. And it was like a, a round bubble. It was like the Mercedes Benz of cases. Um, this doesn't feel bad. This part, though, definitely doesn't feel as hard as the Apple case, but this was a fraction of the price. I got this off of Amazon for like 36 bucks. It had five-star ratings. Um, it's been out for a while. Um, it's known to hold like the Oculus and different VR headsets. Not to mention, um, it's a cross strap. And that's one thing that it has over the Apple case. Apple case did not have any type of cross strap or backpack feature. So let's see what this thing looks like. 36 bucks off of Amazon. This is an alternative. Attention, please read the instructions before using the inner tray box. So we have to open the packaging and place the product on the desktop. It comes with this little, I don't even know what this is, what that's for. It has some straps in here, I guess, to hold, hold it in place. Um, adjust the inner tray to the correct position. Push down. Left and right, secured in the tray, blah, blah, blah. Bottom, 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 blah, 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 blah. So this looks like, this looks like a case to hold accessories. Oh, okay, you can put the accessories in here. I guess if you had like a um, a Quest or any one of those other VR um, headsets that come with accessories, I guess you could put the accessories in here before you put the headset in here. We don't gotta worry about that. Because your eyes are the headset and your hands are the controls um i don't see my cover for this it was around here you know what i think my cover is downstairs so we're just gonna put it about the cover for now just for the sake of the time and for the video just to see but if i pack this up to take it out i'm definitely going to put the cover on with this but as you see as i'm putting it in and i'm gonna take the battery off just to make sure it gets in good. And then we're gonna put the battery where the accessory will go. So right underneath this little accessory strap and then kind of wrap the cord nicely. Stick the cord in here. Um, and actually where the other, there's some pouches in here. So if you want to put like the charging brick in there, the USB-C, close it, zip it. This is small, it's compact. The Apple one was so big for no reason. I would, I'm carrying my Apple Vision Pro in this. This is great. Uh, I don't know what this is. Don't need that. But yeah, so let's see. Uh, where we attach this to? This attaches to something. Uh, probably one of these straps on the side, I guess. I'm never good with these crossbody bags, y'all. I'm really not. I'm not a crossbody bag wearer. So I really don't know how these things work. Hold up. You're going to loosen it up. No? Going the wrong way? This way. This way loosens it. Okay. How you wear a crossbody bag? Anybody know? I don't know. Let's say. Go like this. Uh, is this how you do it? I'm doing it all wrong. I don't know. I got my Apple Vision Pro on my back. I'm ready. 
I'm ready to travel. I'm ready. So if you want, if you want an alternative to the two hundred dollar carrying case that Apple provides for their Vision Pro, this is a good alternative. It's waterproof. It's it's light. Um, the bottom is soft. The top is kind of hard. I wouldn't feel comfortable with banging this around, but who's going to bang Apple Vision Pro around anyway? You're still going to be careful with this in the bag. But I think this is going to do the job just fine until Apple releases a better or cheaper version than that big giant one that they have that is like a travel bag <laughs> for an airplane. But yeah, this holds the things fine. Holds the Apple Vision Pro fine. I'm pleased with this. 36 bucks, Amazon. There you go.